Hey friends, this game has got a, a lot of good things going for it. So um, just stay tuned and I'll show you how it works. But what you're going to need are some tiles that I've made out of cardboard because they don't really blow away. Um, like if you're going to use paper, but the tiles need to have the numbers one and two on them. And you need to make um, probably 10 to 20, um, depending on how many of the other materials that you have. Um, and some of the other materials you'll need are some cups that you can stack. I have um, just some solo cups. Um, if you have some actual stacking cups that you can use like as a toy, then you can use those as well. Um, and then also you're going to need a piece of paper and a pencil so you can come up with your own challenges. I'm going to list my challenges on here um, of the way that you're going to earn tiles. Um, now I'll break down each little part of the game, but that's just kind of an overview of what we're going to do. And um, I will show you how the game works. All right, so here are the tiles and they are face down. And um, I've, it's scribbled out in the back because I was using these for another game. So I'm just trying to recycle the stuff that I have. So when I flip it over, I see that it's either a one or a two. Um, so those are what my tiles are. And out here, I've placed a lot of those cups like I talked about. And you can put even more if you want to. This game can go on for a really long time. But um, the way that you earn cups is by doing physical challenges or even mental challenges. And you'll need someone to help you so that they can check your score to make sure that you got it correct. So one of my physical challenges could be, I have these lights stringing up outside of my house so I can count each individual light. And then the person who is playing with me or checking my score, they have the number um, in there, they have their number written down. And if your number matches their number, then you can come over here and flip over a card. Now you don't have to do that challenge, you can come up with your own. So I got a one for that one. So I'm gonna run down, grab one cup, and bring it back and put it on the table. Now another challenge can be to spell a word. Um, it could be a word that's one of your spelling words um, or uh, just a word that you've been working on. And if you spell it correctly and the person who's playing with you checks it and you do it correctly, then you get to come over here. You get to flip another tile and look, ooh, I get to go down and get two cups this time. So I'm gonna run down to get two cups and put them on the table. Um, once you have either flipped all of these uh, cards over or done all of your challenges, then you have all of these fun cups to create a tower or um, some sort of structure out of, and then you can take a picture of it, and then you can send me what you've done. So um, that is the cup challenge, and it's kind of like a trivia game, physical challenge, and you can kind of make it whatever you want. But um, essentially the point is to do challenges and collect tiles so that you can bring those cups back and make something really cool out of it. All right, hope you all having a good day.